Hello! How is everyone? I'm just trying to reset this stuff so that everything is good. Should probably resize this a bit. I ate uh, shawarma. So that was fun. <clears throat> Stay a while and listen. Is it too high level? Like it's been blasting in my ears that as much as I love uh, the soundtrack, uh, I don't want it to be too distracting. Nagging, wheezing cough. Oh man, it's sorry to hear that. As someone who suffers from a mild um, bronchitis, I understand how you feel. Like, just the coughing itself is annoying. So, I, yep. Likewise, I, I, I hope you get better. Uh, and, yeah, you missed the D. Morin stream, which was a couple of... Well, I was gonna say, I ended it an hour ago. Started at 3 p.m. Eastern Time, so that's like uh, four hours ago. So... How's the volume? Am I alright? Am I, am I too loud? Is the game too loud? Am I not speaking loud enough? Tiny bit. Game volume is a bit loud. Yeah, that's what I thought. It's, I think minus five is about. Well, you know, <clears throat> I was gonna click on my OBS to change like the game, but from here. Always keep it a little bit. So now it's just a matter of the dialogue. So I'm going to talk to um, his wife. Where is she? There she is. Good day. How may I serve you? It was louder. Yeah, I, I think it was. Because it's the same setup, so sound-wise. Well, a caravan of some very important people did stop here. But that was quite a while ago. They had strange accents and were starting on a long journey, as I recall. I don't see how you could hope to find anything that they would have been carrying. Indeed. So I'm just gonna... Was that too loud again? I'll, I'll drop it some more. Now it's perfect, someone says. Okay, so... I'm gonna keep it there. Minus 6.5 decibels should do the trick. So, yesterday, <clears throat> we started a new character. We went through the first floor levels of the cathedral in Tristram. We encountered the butcher. Spent a lot of time, a few trips in town to carry some more potions, and we brought them down. Then we... We defeated the Skeldon King. And that, after a couple of trips again in town to get some potions. I'm, not, I'm still... As much as I play Diablo, I, I tend to play uh, the Sorcerer, so it's like a little bit easier for me to just spam spells. Fireball to the face, Holy Bolt to the face, and they're dead. As a warrior, you kind of get the blunt of the damage, so you gotta carry a lot of health potions, and I'm not used to that. So, um... I, I, I alternate when I play, so... Uh, the warrior has been... Two years since I played him. Yeah. And then we found some little demonic thing that wanted a sign from the big uglies. 
And when we gave him a, 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 a sign, like actually like a wooden sign, uh, that little bugger with his friends started to attack. So we cleared him up, and now we're in the catacombs. What ails well, you, my friend? Well, technically, right now we're in town. That should be enough. I'm not fighting a boss. So... Let's dive right in. And explore the catacombs. I don't remember casting a town portal. Oh yeah. Because of the... Right. I forgot I did that. Cool. Of course, when you reload, they close all the doors, so it's kind of hard to see where you've been. Oh, well, I've not been here. got swords of skill? No. Um, I've got... Well, it's the plus eight to dexterity. I had that. That's what I used to hit the Skeleton King with, which did piss poor damage. Right now I'm using the, uh, the Butcher's Cleaver, which practically kills most things in one hit. Dude. Like it takes one firebolt. Let me, let me take a there you go, firebolt. Oh, that's why they're stronger. Okay, they're part of a unique pack. There you go. Not enough mana. Yeah, not enough mana. It's supposed to be a joke. Ha ha ha. Sorry, I'm not. <laughs> it, 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 because I used it, and I didn't do too good with it. It kind of... Yeah, you missed the uh, the butcher. You, um, I think the Skeleton King fight was a little bit more noteworthy, but the butcher is always a good... Um, Good armor. I'm equipped with like three unique items. <laughs> so, oh, hello. So now, if you're familiar with like the the multiplayer version of this game, the, uh, all I'm left with is to kill Lazarus. Lazarus, the wizard Lazarus, and then Diablo. So, technically our goal right now is to get, I think Lazarus is in the 14th floor? Eh, maybe 10th, I'm not too sure anymore. And um, we'll get quests as we go. Like in between. Which version of the game? Um, 
the last patch I don't have the numbers with me right now it showed earlier in the main menu uh, without the Hellfire expansion I should probably play that I have never played that expansion my excuse to that was that back in those days um, Hellfire never existed on the Mac I killed everything already, so never played it. But now that I'm actually running this, and this is the only way for me to run it on my computer, is I'm running it on Windows. So maybe I should invest um, a, to find a copy of uh, Hellfire, and install it, and play it for the like very first time. That I would love to do. I want to. some windows around so I can cheat chat better. See because of your reference while playing Skyrim and experience for request murder. Oh yeah, um I was gonna say like I might remove him but like the video but like it's in the um VOD as you call them, VODs on Skype so you can probably rewatch I think I've cleared the floor, so I'm just gonna go down to floor six. I already know where this floor is. And then the difficulty kind of got just got jumped up a bit because um, I'm already down to four potions. Normally, a full bar get, um, allows me to go through at least two floors. Hmm. There's a shrine here. <laughs> I was expecting it to be trapped. Beyond the Hall of Heroes lies the Chamber of Bone. Eternal death awaits any who would seek to steal the treasures secured within this room. So speaks the Lord of Terror, and so it is written. The Room of Bones, the Chamber of Bones, uh... Wow, that brings me back. Yeah, I think it's mixed with the um, Dark Souls 2 VOD. Because um, normally when I start playing, I don't. Did I replace my holdable? Yes, I did. Shouldn't have done that. The lightning spell kind of sucks. Good for aliens. There you go. Oh, I missed. Done. Too much baggage. Too much baggage. Ugh. Oh, stuff of lightning. Good. You already found the Diablo uh, section of it? That's awesome. <laughs> it's gonna get rated R once the Sukaboos are gonna start popping up. <laughs> Yeah, level up. I was expecting that. All right. Good point. I still have books. It's like my guy is almost like a wizard. Uh, I need 
A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Ocean of healing, awesome. <laughs> Portal time. No, 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 no. <laughs> Only when I'm desperate. So four to seven is there. Now the thing is that some people will just go straight to uh, as far down as they, they can as fast as possible because that's where the loot is and get more experience and kill and all that stuff. But, uh, specifically, like, every floor has uh, a handful of quests. Uh, in this particular case, I unlocked the Chamber of Nodes. So, I'm hoping to find it. And, uh, get some loot. And this is basically how you build a paladin uh, class in Diablo 1, is you play a warrior, you invest in mana, and then you just chug uh, holy bolts everywhere. There's a bow. I don't have a scroll, right? I guess I, I will have to make a trip. Done. <laughs> 32, 32, 45, 40, and Zam energy comes at the cost of wisdom. I saw some numbers change at the bottom. Not exactly sure what happened. <laughs> Ring! Oh, okay, now I have to go back up. Oh, it's an amulet. Okay. Still good. Not enough mana. Not enough mana. Well, not enough mana. Wow, really? Not enough mana to heal. All right. I'm scared to hit the F6 key because the F6 kind of breaks my heart.